Club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this. The final itself. Who will prevail? It's Manchester City. They take on Real Madrid. And it's coming up next on EA TV. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It is Manchester City, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium, and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? And so they starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Fernando Silva plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Kepa begins in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside David Alaba in central defence. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Well, not many would debate the point that Erling Haaland is a joy to watch whenever he's out there on the pitch. But what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player. But it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. And in with a real chance. No problems for the keeper. short just to get a different angle on the cross and it ends up with a fairly simple finish certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that so City get the match restarted can they come up with an equaliser having conceded Alvarez Could be dangerous 
if he's not careful. Gives it a go. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. Real doing well to win it back. Mendy. in possession from Real. Oh, him with a chance! Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. from City Federico Valverde and now Rodrigo the referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time but he knew he had to get to the ball and he did and the referee's whistle that will conclude the first half here at Wembley Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. And moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. And Real Madrid have the ball again. sequence but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end well, racing past his man well a fierce effort but quite simply not accurate enough the ball back with Real now Chouameni. Foden. And it's a quality pass. Foden. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. They're really pressing their opponents. Rodrigo, Federico Valverde, and the ball back with City now, exploiting the wide area, oh 
Holland. The fans are shouting, shoot! Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Vinicius Junior. Now perhaps they can counter from here. Rodrigo. And take it away. Rodri. It's a neat move. He takes on the shot. Oh, great block. A nicely cut out. Mendy. It's with Vinicius Junior. So a throw in for Real Madrid. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. And a great play. And he's broken free. Well, plenty of zip on the shot, but he couldn't put it away. Well, you're right. He certainly strikes it well, but he's got his angles all wrong there. Take it away. But he's certainly not alone. And it's through here. And really going for power, but the opportunity's been squandered. But I'm not sure going for power was the right option. I think that should have been placed into the corner. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Well, you can't take your eyes off this one, because there you have it. Plenty of chances for both teams in what has been a really good game so far. Beating his opponent with ease. Good defending in the end, and danger averted for now. They're trying to get right into his face. Might be a chance to break. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Excellent use of advantage from the referee in City's favour. Slide for what will be a Real Madrid throw. Substitution for Real Madrid. Number 10, Luka Modric. Mendy. Ten minutes left for play. Bernardo Silva. Well, it did look promising, but no threat in the end. in here oh but beaten by a goalkeeper imbued with confidence well he's just saved his team there what a time to pull off a save like that so a personnel change then clearance left a bit to be desired now well, the counter attack looks on a bit profit from this situation oh good looking run of goalkeeping Alvarez well, this could be productive and there it is full time Manchester City Champions League winners well, just look at the emotions out there 
joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement for them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester City. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic.